this Black Friday, you can sleep in. Black all over the region. Retailers are calling this their super... 149,000 stores offering sales in the greater metro. sales changing hands. The stores. The flu season is off to its earliest start. Appears to be a previously unknown variant of the flu. Suspected case catching many experts off guard. Today I was feeling like maybe I. Back on the breaking news, leading with unconfirmed reports of a smallpox small outbreak. outbreak is a highly rehearsed scenario. And National Guard units converging no on a hospital trains. in Central Bridges Manhattan. are closed. It's a war zone. is a very real more danger. More than There's not enough vaccines. No, let me going. stop you there. This is not a panic situation. An entire American city. Well known as the Green Poison, Central Park has been converted to a mass burial ground. Power outages, gas line leaks, fires. The government is expecting another night of widespread looting. The people of New York are begging for more of us. Yeah, but first responders are either dead. No or resources available. They treat them like animals. It's not a job. We're not trained for. When we were activated, we knew the situation was bad. Worse than anyone knew. We are an elite, highly skilled group of embedded agents. They only call us when everything else has failed. We have no rules. We have no limits. Our job is to protect what remains. We are your co-workers. We are your neighbors. We might even be your friends. But when we get the call, we leave everything behind. We are the division. This area is safe. We're losing this whole neighborhood. Riders are moving through, in force, and headed this way. Put your people there. I see someone else got the call. I'm Agent Fei Lao, Division. Activated at the same time as you, part of the second wave of us going in. I don't know what happened to the first wave, but unfortunately, there's still lots left for us to do. We don't have much intel, and we don't have the luxury of failure. Not with Manhattan under lockdown and Brooklyn on the brink. People like me, and you, we're what's left to hold the line. With any luck, we'll have more to go on once we rendezvous with the commander. More about the situation, about who's turning the streets into a war zone. Anything that's gonna help us do what we're supposed to do. And if you'll excuse me, Lieutenant. Officer Hazen and his team are handling situation reports. If you're looking for a hot spot, that's who you want to talk to. Agent, Riders took the weekly food supply from the Brooklyn Heights Distribution Center. They try and sell it back to all the starving people. Plain and simple profiteering on the backs of people who are suffering. Get that food back. I'm begging you, I got a family, yeah? located.
Charging marked location. Come on. Area secured. Hostiles neutralized. Forces approaching. feeling real glib at the moment. So I went uptown. Decided to have a look for myself at this dark zone. What I have to report ain't hearsay. I saw it with my own eyes. First off, the wall is still there. It's gotten bigger. Confirmed. Pick up Mark. GTF notified. In December they were saying Great work, Agent. We'll get that food else. back to the people who need now, it. Now I think they just don't want anybody to know what's...